Hi everybody, thanks for stopping by of Michaela's Minute. I did a Facebook live feed the other day and I talked briefly about earnest money and I would like to pick that up and go into just a tad more detail about earnest money. So theoretically it is possible to purchase a property with or have a binding contract without putting down earnest money in real life that doesn't happen and yes you have to have earnest money the amount of this deposit it depends on the purchase price of the property you want to buy if it is um, it is usually between five hundred and five thousand dollars and if your house that you want to buy is more like a million dollars or eight hundred thousand then your earnest money should reflect that and be closer to the five thousand range than the five hundred range um earnest money is basically there for you, for the seller to see how serious you are about buying that house and that you have some skin in the game that it is a serious endeavor for you as well and you're willing to put your money where your mouth is, so to speak. If you are, however, in a multiple offer situation, you don't really have a choice. You have to put down as much as you can in order to have the best possibility to get your offer accepted. So once your offer is accepted with your earnest money, then your agent will either give you a special link where you can deposit the money into the listing brokerage account right away and it goes from your account into their account without um, any delay and it is done right away instantaneously you will get notified when it has been done and uh, when it has been received which is very important because there's only a very short time frame of where that you have to have that earnest money into the other agent's brokerage. Um, I don't know how other agents do it. I heard many ways how uh, people do it if the buyer decides to write a check, which is also within your right, of course, and within the possibility, though most people, I will say, are using the online option at this point. Not everybody does, though. So if you wish to write a check or have to write a check, then um, I personally will never, ever, ever drop that just in the mail and hope that it makes it and hope it doesn't get lost. I don't even know if it would be possible to be in the other brokerage's hands at that, in that time frame that is allotted. So, plus it's a lot of money, so I'm not just gonna drop that in a mailbox. I'm driving that over to the listing brokerage, have it into their hands, get a receipt so that everybody is happy, everybody knows it has been delivered, it has been done. That part of the contract has been properly executed. So, that was that for earnest money. If you have any questions, please let me know. I'd be happy to help. If you um, would like to talk about anything um, that I can put uh, in a little video clip, let me know that too, that would be great. And my phone number is 612-345-9070. If you wanna call, text or whatever, or email, <coughs> that's on my website. Uh, smoke signals take a little bit longer. I'm not so good at that, but other than that, Give me a buzz and we take it from there. You have a good one.